Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Daryl Addison, and these are torpedo pots. These are self-growing flower pots. They grow your food for you without you having to be there. I went on two vacations, and I'm enjoying myself with my carrots. Yes, we've already picked one harvest, and you're looking at about 10 planters that is growing nothing but carrots. And so I came out today because I want to eat some carrots. Well, these planters, these torpedo pots, they grow my carrots. I took 1,000 seeds, put it in all of these planters, and guess what? Look what they're growing now. Beautiful, delicious carrots. Isn't that amazing? I love it. So, right now I came out to harvest some of my carrots. So, all I do is reach down into the base of the planter, find me what I want to pull out, and pull it out. And I get carrots all of the time. Now, the first harvest I had were the younger ones. These are getting a little bit older. So it's best that I start picking them out now because now that they're older, they take up more space. And that odor is gonna provide me with a lot of nutrition. And they're absolutely beautiful. This is torpedo pots. These planters that you see right in front of you right now, they water and feed your plants for you. You don't have to do anything. And in return, you get delicious food for you and your family all of the time. Look how perfect that is. These are baby carrots. Now, we've already, like I said, this is our uh, second harvest. And so I'm gonna to continue to pull these out of here so we can have more carrots. Now, I wanna have a nice spicy meal. There are 10 of these planters and I really do need to come out and thin them out. As much as I need to come out here and thin these plants out because there's so many carrots coming out of this planter. Be careful, make sure you get them all. This is what harvesting your food does. Isn't that beautiful? These torpedo pots, guys. All you do is take your seeds and put them in this planter. And these planters you see behind me, we put about a thousand seeds. And we're harvesting a thousand carrots. Now, I can choose what size I want them to grow. If I want to harvest them as microgreens when they're a lot smarter, I, smaller, I harvest them. If I want to harvest them as big tender plants, I harvest them. Or I can let them stay during the winter time, let them run through to get nice, big and juicy. That's how I choose to harvest my carrots is what I do. But it doesn't make a difference because no matter what stage of harvest or what life cycle you're at, you're going to get delicious, healthy food. Not some of the time, all of the time. That's just one planter. And you, you, looking at what I've done, looks like I haven't even done anything at all. But you know what? I'm gonna have a great meal. I'm gonna come out and do a longer video where we're pulling up a lot more of these carrots. But man, that's beautiful. And it's absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna stop there. I got uh, nine more planters to do. I just want a little snack. Actually, you know what? Let me finish out even more. Cause this little bit may not do anything for me. Guys, these are torpedo pots. They grow your food for you without you having to be there. You simply just drop your seeds in and it grows your, literally grows your food for you. Oh, look at that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful carrot. And no matter what you do, they're all successful. So in my hand, I have this count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Probably broken off. So 20. Let's see if we get 20 more out of this one planter. And it doesn't look identity, does it? All right. 21, 22. 23, 24. 25, 26. 27, 28. You know what? I've got some more. I'm going to pick over here. 29, 30. 31, 32, 33. 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 40 small, delicious carrots that we can have. Guys, these are torpedo pots. These torpedo pots grow your food for you. You never water your plants again. It waters them for you. 
Look how beautiful this is. You see no blemishes on any of these carrot tops and certainly nothing on the carrot bottom. They're absolutely stunning and they're beautiful. This is how you should be eating all of the time. No blemishes. It should be pure, healthy, green, gorgeous. That's how you should be eating. And the way to go there is with the torpedo pot. It gets you to where you need to be at. So you and your family are almost guaranteed food for the rest of your life. Just imagine the soil that's in this torpedo pot. It's been growing all these carrots. You know how much it's depleted? I don't know, maybe about an inch. I don't expect it to deplete very much at all. And in turn, we're growing thousands of carrots. Torpedo Pot grows your food for you. You'll never have to water or take care of your plants again. Dow Radisson, torpedopot.com. I've got a lot more to pick, and this is only one plant. And look, look like it's, I barely even touched it, doesn't it? That's what your Torpedo Pot does for you. You want food on demand. This is a lot of food, a lot of food. This is a lot of food. If you had to pay for this at the supermarket, do you imagine how much they charge you for something this healthy, this beautiful? Oh my gosh, dude, quite a bit. And guess what? Torpedo Pot, the self-growing system that we've developed, grows perfect food all of the time. And that's what I want you to have. So you don't have to worry about something coming you're a lot of the mold and things building up and fungus building up in your planters and bacteria. And you don't have to worry about that when it comes to torpedo pot. It eliminates that because your plants are being fed underneath the ground. And it developed a, a sustainable biotic environment which grows your food naturally and organically. And it grows it perfectly. So you get perfect food all of the time. And that's why I have no blemishes on my food. My food is perfect all of the time. Daryl Addison, torpedopot.com. Thank you guys for listening. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Time to cook. How am I going to cook these? Well, I don't know. These carrots, because I dropped my seeds and I have all these carrots in my hand right now, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to stir fry them with some, a little bit of rice or quinoa and just let it just saute in. And I'm going to eat the tops as well as the bottoms. The tops are just... It's healthy and it's fresh and it's buoyant. Oh, I love it. Oh, and you'll eat fresh all the time. And that's what I do. So I take the tops and I'll cut them into small pieces because they're tender. See, that's why I grow them when they're young like this. Because when you drop all those seeds in a torpedo pot, you get that young growth. Remember now, we dropped over 300 seeds in this one planter. And they grew our carrots for us, okay? And so when we took those 300 seeds and dropped them in, our first harvest, what we wanted was young ten shoots, tender shoots and tender bottom, and we got that. The first harvest was 1.3 pounds. It was younger than this. This is the second harvest. I don't need much to achieve that 1.3 pounds. So they're getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And I have a lot more to choose from as they get bigger because there's more room in the pot for them to grow. Daryl Addison, torpedopot.com, where we make self-growing planters that waters your plants for you. It takes care of your plants. It grows your plants for you with no human intervention. We want to remove you from the picture. The way you've been taught and how you're approaching and looking at your food and how you're looking at plants needs to be corrected, shifted. The concept and the ideas are great, but we need a growing solution that makes all of this food sustainable. That means you can do it over and over and over and over and over and over again. We call that precision growing. We're very precise. So much so that we're developing accuracy standards that cannot be achieved in the industry under any other conditions. At the same time, saving water, and you can use your soil indefinitely. So, PewDiePie.com, looking out for you. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.